So we have several nice pods of mineralization here. You have a nice vein structure running through here. You can see this quartz up there. You have quartz back there with magnetite, quartz up here. Nice big pods right there. So this varies in thickness from about 40 centimeters up to about two meters in this area. Um, it's exposed on several spots along this road. Um, and I think this is going to be a pretty promising showing. You can see how deteriorated this is right here. Quartz veining in here. Just crazy buggy. You got your schistose rock here. Sulfides. Sulfides everywhere. So here's a few of the samples that I just pulled off. Here's a pot of uh, magnetite, iron sulfides, pyrite, a bit of cocoa pyrite in there. I've just been working here a bit because I noticed something interesting. What looks like you have sphalerite here. Definitely looks like it under the loop. Definitely smells like sphalerite. Sphalerite isn't the nicest smelling mineral. You got this white deteriorated stuff here. It almost looks like quartz. But it's really hard to tell. So a couple nice samples. Here's a sample of quartz with pyrite, more sphalerite. Here's a deteriorated oxidized piece. Some magnetite there. You got chlorite schists in here. Very chloritized. Pyrite in your quartz. Same with this. Another deteriorated piece. You can see a little piece of pyrite there. This one's a little heavier than this one, so this obviously still has some sulfides in it. Hasn't oxidized out. Here's a nice hunk of magnetite. Another one here. And a couple more pieces with pyrite in chloride chests. A little bit of quartz attached there. So this is where I'm noticing the, the sphalerite right here. Look at how deteriorated this vein is. Got some limonite. Definite massive mineralization. So I've been removing pieces from this uh, showing here. There's lots of mineralization, lots of iron sulfides, but at the bottom side here, I removed a huge chunk and there's definitely something going in behind the showing or running through it. This right here is deteriorated quartz. Those dark spots are sphalerite.
clears day under the loop. It's got that sphalerite smell to it. This is just really, really deteriorated in here. This is all sulfides right here. So that's pretty interesting. Yeah, you can see it right there. All this darker stuff is sphalerite. So there's definite sphalerite between some of the layering of your pyrite and your schists. Lots of samples with massive sulfides. Lots of magnetite. So there's some uh, sphalerite right there. That's a good sign. It looks like it would be a decent grade. Anyway, that's the showing. We don't have any more time to spend here today. We've already removed quite a bit. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. See you later.